Welcome back to 100 Days of Logic with 90 Second Philosophy and Carnadies.org. Today we're going to be continuing with categorical logic, looking at quantifiers and copula. So we'll start off with some definitions. Quantifiers. Quantifiers are words that talk about how much of the subject class is included in the predicate class. These are words like all, no, or some. Copula, on the other hand, are words that couple, copula, couple, the subject and the predicate terms. These are words like are and are not. If those are a little confusing, let's take a look at some examples. So, in any categorical proposition, you have four words. You have a quantifier, you have a subject, you have a copula, and you have a predicate. They're not necessarily all a single word, but you have four different parts. So, quantifier could be something like all, subject could be something like dogs, copula, are and the predicate mammals and we get all dogs are mammals you could also have no fish are philosophers no being our quantifier fish being our subject are being our copula and philosophers being our predicate you could have some women are republicans or even some philosophers are not crazy all of these are examples of categorical propositions because they all have a quantifier a subject a copula and a predicate in fact they're four of the most important types of categorical propositions that you'll see. That was quantifiers and copula. Next up, we're going to be looking at universal, particular, affirmative, and negative, and then the four different types of categorical propositions that you, in fact, just saw. Watch a new video every single day for 100 days here at carnadies.org, and stay skeptical, everybody.